Please give a big welcome to the author of the best-selling book, Be Your Own Brand, and president of Brand Toolbox, Mr. Carl Speak. Thank you, Jeremy. Appreciate it. Let me tell you what my objective here is in the next 45 minutes to an hour. It's to provide you with a new set of insights and tools, all focused around you enhancing your ability to build relationships with customers, with prospects, and frankly, with all the people you interact with in your personal and professional life. I'm going to do that by sharing with you some of the things that I've learned and some of the tools I've learned about this idea of personal brand, about being more of who you are, about you achieving more of what you want by being more of who you are. And then finally, what I want to do is bring it around to providing you a framework where you can maximize the amount of brand power that you want to have to be as successful as you want to be. And that framework is helping you understand the importance and the leverage that you will get when you find alignment between who you are and who level three is. Or to put it in business context, to find alignment between your personal brand and a level three brand. So how many of you, by show of applause, think the product brand plays the largest role in customer loyalty? Give me an applause. All right, so far, kind of what we expect. How many of you think that if you had to pick the corp if you had to pick one of the three, that the corporate brand would be the largest driver of customer loyalty? All right, sounds good. And I guess by default then, uh, well, you show me. How many of you think the personal brand is of those three the single largest driver of customer loyalty? Let me hear. It. So I assume because you are, our you are business professionals, that wasn't a self-serving <laughs> comment. And the truth of the matter is, let me emphasize something I'm going to say over and over again. That is, it's not about any one of these brands. The power, the strongest brands in any category have found a way to create alignment again with all three of these. I'm here to talk to you about brand, but in particular, talk to you about brand in a way that matters very much to you. It's about personal brand. Now, personal brand is a tool that, as I present these concepts to you today, is a tool that will help you enhance your relationship building skills with your clients. Be more of who you are and not less. The principles of personal brand are about helping you become more of who you are and not less. Don't change, but learn to be more of who you are. And that's, that's the, uh, the underlying idea here. There are three principles of strong brands, personal brands. And I'm going to go over each one of these for you. First of all, brands are perceptions. Second of all, strong brands are, are noted to be distinctive, relevant, and consistent. And finally, a strong brand is about making a difference. The idea here is all three of these are straightforward concepts. There's nothing difficult about these ideas. They're common sense. But in fact, I want to help you understand how you can be more proactive in applying these common sense rules. The level of customer engagement is a direct reflection, it's a mere reflection of the level of employee engagement. And to turn it into a positive, when employees are engaged around the same things that matter to the customer, then customer-centric cultures are the ones that win the most often. Do you make a difference? How much of a difference do you make? How do you know you make a difference? Do you challenge yourself in every relationship to make a difference? Make a difference in their minds, not yours. <laughs> I just want to leave you with one note, and I know you want to get going. You've got some work to do. Right, a couple of things. One is as you go in your work groups and you're here the rest of the week, and this is a commitment by your company, is start talking about the brand. Bring the brand to bear in your work groups. Challenge each other about the brand and be proud of this brand. And I really hope that as you all gave me the applause up front when you believe that this organization can be a strong brand because you believe in the brand, again, it starts with you. Okay, and so dare to be your own brand. Um, and, and thank you very much for, for allowing me to be in front of you guys. I enjoyed it. Thanks for the applause. Thank you, Carl.